Okay. I shall not fail. We will do a deliver again. Um, of course, stealth. Uh, don't really care that much. perception, of course. I'm not a persuasive individual, not knowledgeable. Let's go with mobility and athletics. Okay. Slayer talents. Um, let us see. Mystery seeker. A rogue with his talents has no knowledge of kind of no. Train mastery. Weakening wound. When making a sneak attack against a creature that has damage reduction, the character's attack reduces the that damage for two rounds by an amount equal to the character's level. This penalty to damage reduction does not stack. Oh my god, what am I wanting to do here? Combat style feat. Ranger. Two weapon combat, weapon and shield. At second level, the ranger can select the she a shield from sl shield bash, shield focus, and two weapon fighting. Yeah, I'm not sure about that. Combat trick. Your familiarity with specific types of armor increases the amount of protection you receive from it. Hmm. Cleaving finish. If you make a melee attack and your target drops to zero uh, or fewer hit points as a result of your attack, you can make another melee attack using your highest base attack bonus against another opponent within reach. You can make it only one extra attack per round with this feat. Okay. Okay. Dodge. Hmm. Great cleave. So. That seems cool. Or do I take dodge? Great cleave. As a standard action, you can make a single attack at your full base attack against the foe within reach. If you hit, you deal damage normal. Okay. No, I don't want a weapon focus. My base attack bonus isn't high enough. All right. I'm just going to be stupid here and uh, go with cleaving finish because blind fight. Focusing. Mr. Seeker, Slippery Mind, Slow Reaction. Opponents damaged by the character's sneak attack can make attacks of opportunity for one. Hmm. Making a sneak against a creature that has damage reduction. Yeah. I would like to have better sneak attack, but. Mm -hmm. Crazy. All right. <laughs> if anyone has any suggestions, don't hesitate to throw it out there. Um, ooh, fast stealth. Let's see. 
shield shield under armor okay cleaving finish so if I reduce someone down I can then hit someone else sounds good to me no reason to pause all right let's go level up paladin again um, really 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 not sure what I should do with you It's like trickery and mobility and athletics aren't there. Stealth is almost nothing, but all right. Um, okay, now you have lore, lore, and lore. Not that you're ever going to be one of our lore masters, but there you go. Um, Third, third level, sixth level. Three levels after that. Um, so that lay on hands. Okay. Let's go with diseased. There. Okay. Um, I do not have enough of these things. What is um, <laughs> stealth? Uh, no, persuasion. Uh, there we go. Well, let's go with world. There we go. Next. Hmm. Smite evil additional. Let's see. Cleaving finish. Yes. New spells. Arrow of law. Nice. Delay poison. Resist energy. All right. What? I'm confused. Am I just hitting the same thing over and over again? When did she get to level eight? Okay. I'm somewhat confused. Um. There. Don't mind me. This seems weird. Let us bide our time. Level six, level eight. Athletics. Um, 
athletics, bark skin, mini shot. Why did Sila go to level eight? <laughs> six, eight, six. Did I just find a glitch? Now see this level eight all of a sudden? Uh, I'm just gonna, yeah, accept that. You go. Uh, Arcana. Yeah. Well, that's interesting. Okay. Level up. Next. Wizard. Uh, use magic device. And your knowledge is there. You go. Let's see. Two. Battering blast. You hurl fist size ball force. Okay. Yes. And haste. Okay. Next. Okay. Um. Point blank shot. Greater invisibility. Phantasmal killer. Greater invisibility. Why not? Well, intelligence up to 20. One, two, three, and four. Oh, wow. Um, well, uh, perception, a lower religion. There you go. Next, rainbow pattern, and ice storm. Yeah, yeah. Why not? Sounds good. Doubt is the heart's greatest challenge. Not exactly we'll sure. Right. Okay. Next. Uh, use magic device. There you go. Um, okay. Cackle. A witch can cackle. Madly as a move action. Well, nails. No, misfortune.
evil eye. Yeah, evil eye. Evil eye. Um, summon monster three. Level up. Not exactly sure what was going on here. One, two, three. Try that. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Do I like that? Yeah. In case people get close to her, now she has something to do. All right. Um, molten orb. Fester. Product energy permeates the target blocking healing abilities. To dexterity. Okay. Layered mass of strong stick stands. These strands trap those caught in them. Okay. You weaken the target defense against poison, inflict moderate wounds, false life. Huh. Blindness. Molten orb. Interesting. Go with Molten Orb. I don't just... Hmm. Snowball. I like a large person. Let's go. Alright. I still do not understand what's going on here. Yes. Charisma's Wisdom. Next. <sighs> Healing. This hex is a cure light wound spell using the witch's castle once a creature has benefited from the hex. Okay. Diseases and how poison nauseous gaseous effects such as in cloud are negated in a ten foot aura. Hmm. All this is very interesting though. I do not know why she's getting why the certain certain characters are going up to level eight, nine, whatever. Makes no sense to me, but Ice Plant, there we go. She needs that. Um, Cape of Wasps. 
A wasp swarm which does not attack you, the dense cloud of vermin, gives you a partial concealment against ranged attacks. Any creature that makes a successful melee attack against you takes 2d6 points of swarm damage. Ooh. Okay. Uh, 3d6 bludgeoning damage. Okay. Your critical wounds. Yep. What? I still am not understanding this. Something is not right here. Okay. Um, some monster four, just for the hell of it. Cure serious wounds. Some of monsters all over the place. All right. She's going with me everywhere. So one creature was causing them suffer intense pain. The target is nauseated for a number of rounds equal to the witch's level. Okay. <laughs> Hold monster. Okay, this this has got to be some sort of glitch. This is just stupid. Has anyone seen this before? Cave of Fangs. So we don't know what to do. Castle Wave of Fatigue. Someone must be my thing. Well, I'll show you in a second. Um, inflict light wounds mass. I'm going to show you here in a second. Um, Do, 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 do. See invisibility. She's a level 11. Now it tells me she can level up. Everyone counts on level 6. Level 8. Level 6. Level 8. Level 6. If I kept going, I could have made her as many levels as I wanted to. She's now a level 11. 
It's it's a glitch. I could have just kept raising her level until level 20, I would suppose. But now I have a level 11 witch. Uh, level 8 paladin. Level 6 me. Yeah, I have to report that. Yeah, I know. Um, cutscenes. Aspect. Uh, mechanics. <laughs> Yeah, that was uh, Discord optional. Uh, uh, level up after um, attack if I stayed on character I could level them up as many times as I wanted um, until I moved to a different character. Uh, I think that's a critical thing, Send. Yeah, that's... Uh, I, I still don't know what the M's for. I would have thought that that would have meant I would have been able to do some sort of mythic path. So now let me go. If I go back into them, see if I go back in. If they're still yeah, still elevate. I I got my level eleven witch. Ah, uh, yeah. Click the M. If I click the... I was just clicking the character. Clicking the M. Mythic Companion. Next. Uh, ever ready? Yeah, I was clicking them thinking that there would be a button somewhere. I didn't know I had to specifically click the M. <sighs> That's all right. I, I, I had some issues in other things where I thought things were a bug, and it turns out I was just doing the mechanic wrong there, too. Uh, it's a wonderful thing. It's a wonderful thing. Um... Your healing is no longer affected by common limitations. Whenever you cast a cure wounds spell or no another, it becomes reach as though using the reach spell. Yeah. Let's see. What? Leading strike. Yeah, she should have leading strike. Uh, once per day when you're at H-Pups. No, leading strike. Leading strike. Your strike. Uh, every time you hit a target in melee camp, you leave a mark on it. An ally attacking the marked target deals additional divine damage equals to 1d6. Next. Next. Boom. Mythic Companion. All right. Cleaving shot. Each time you deal critical damage with your ranged weapon attack or reduce the target to zero hit points, you, de you deal your weapon damage to all other enemies in 10 foot radius. Yeah, that'll work for you. Okay. You've learned a way to increase the number of spells you can cast per day. You can cast four more spells per day of first, second, and... Yeah, I think that's going to be... Yeah. yeah. There you go. Abundant casting. Because, <laughs> you know, she has... She has all these amazing... Uh, She's a level 11, so you just get all kinds of... There we go. Okay. Um, you... Boundless healing. 
Yes, your effect. Is there in, anything about increased healing? Um, strike, magical, strike, mythic, change. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. Okay. There you go. All right. So, um, yeah, you need some healing. Uh, I mean, stop. Want of his. My will is resolute. I will lend you my aid. Okay, you need one of those. One of those. Deuce person. Uh. <laughs> All right, so let's use that. And then use that. And then use that. Okay. Well, this will be interesting seeing what uh, she can do with her newfound level.